The SA Gullis 2 will embark on the next leg of the International Indian Ocean Research Expedition 2. The vessel will be deployed to conduct wide-ranging marine research along Africa's east coast. Sixty-seven scientists will be travelling from Durban to Tanzania. Okay, so my job entails characterising the seafloor. So, looking at the critters, looking at the environmental variables and trying to understand. So, basically you cannot, once again, I like, I like to emphasise this, you cannot manage what you do not know. So, my part, part of my job is to basically document what we find in the sea bottom. Okay, so this is a rugged sled and basically uh, you operate it at the aft of the vessel. You basically need three times more cable um, and the idea is you just tow it behind for X amount of time and then you get some physical samples, invertebrates or you get some sediments. is um, a 15 minute walk of uh, bleak bongo and what's in it right now at the moment is an abundance of uh, plankton um, there might be some larvae we'll have a look now under the microscope and to really analyze what's in the water column and how pleased are you with this is this a good result this is a very good wall um, for this side of the wall it's a very good wall we've got lots of there's lots of bugs in there we'll, we'll soon find out <laughs> if there are larvae in there for this young man city distance for conductivity, uh, depth and temperature. So what it does, as you can see, it has got um, bottles. We call those Niskin bottles. So we are able to deploy this CDD, as you've seen, to whatever depth we want in the ocean. Uh, it can be to the bottom of the ocean. Uh, we've been to areas where the ocean is about 5,000 meters, like 5,000 meters deep, kilometers deep, like that deep, and, and we were able to deploy this CDD into a deeper ocean as well. So what it, what it does when it comes up, we are able to close those bottles at whatever depth we want, we're interested in, and collect a seawater sample. Okay, here we were taking samples from the CTD. When it came up, we have to take samples for dissolved oxygen, um, things like dissolving organic carbons, chlorophyll, uh, nutrients, uh, salinity. Along with experienced experts, the boat has also welcomed some newcomers who are conducting the in-service training. The vessel is scheduled to arrive in Dar es Salaam next month.